we wrote extensively about the complicated technology underpinning the new engine last year. It's the latest novel development that could represent a range extender, if you will, for the embattled internal combustion engine in an era when automakers and governments are shifting their focus to electric vehicles. The VCT is a new inline 4, 2.0 liter that combines the power of a high performance turbo gasoline engine with the torque and efficiency of an advanced diesel engine, but without the latter's notorious emissions. It features the ability to seamlessly raise or lower the stroke of the pistons in the combustion chamber, depending on the driving conditions it detects and inputs from the driver. To select the best compression ratio, anywhere between 8 to 1, typical for high performance engines and 14 to 1 for high efficiency. In essence, it delivers the performance of a V6 but is much more efficient, with improved fuel efficiency of between 10 to 15 percent with its best competitors, per car and driver. You can view how it works in motion via the video below. It's also quieter, more lightweight and compact than V6 engines with comparable power outputs, estimated at 268 horsepower and 288 pound-feet of torque. In a prototype test drive, car and driver writes that the engine felt very conventional and responsive, with strong and smooth acceleration. The only indication you have that the compression ratio is changing is from an indicator in the instrument cluster next to the boost gauge. The engine is expected to deliver fuel economy gains of 27% in combined city highway EPA rating over the outgoing QX50, which had a 3.7-liter V6. The 2019 model, fitted with a VCT, should get about 26 miles per gallon in combined fuel economy, and it will get to 60 miles per hour almost one second faster than its four-cylinder counterparts, Nissan's chief powertrain engineer. Shinichi Kiga, told Automotive News.